So you guys, you already know this Shamika, and you got I got my twin right here, my evil twin, Shamika number two. Yeah, we with. Okay, so right now we about to give you a story time based off a real story time that I found out my boyfriend was a DL. Yeah, and I, I had two minutes on. Oh my god, this is gonna be crazy. So yeah, you guys, let's get into it and let's do it. You got anything you want to say? No. No. Okay. Girl, why you acting so dry? Oh, girl. I'm but gonna... anyway, let's go ahead and get started. So I don't remember exactly what year this was, but I know it was around the time that I just got a four-year relationship. So it had to be around when I was like 21, 22. So yeah, uh, it could have been twenty three. Oh, twenty three. Whatever. So I was trying not to be in a relationship no more, and that would happen. And yeah, if I I find out that it was the worst way of doing it, <sighs> because guys, it, it it was something else. <laughs> Why are you looking like that, girl? Anyway. <laughs> So, me just getting out a long relationship, whatever the case is, I just want to have a little fun. So, I um, I had a homegirl that said she got some brothers. So, we supposed to, we actually just met up because she needed to drop some out to them. So, okay, I'm not knowing that she had a brother because I didn't know her long enough to the point, you know, whatever. And then, so, when we got to the, it, it's like a, a stay line thing. It's not like a yeah. hotel. They were staying there, him and her homeboy. I'm going I'm to call the guy who I, I was talking to. See? Secret. Call Secret. What? Secret. Ooh, I like that. Secret. I'm gonna call him Secret. Yeah, Secret got down. <laughs> uh, he had a homeboy named uh, Big C. So, yeah, they both stayed together. So, they pretty much worked together and everything. They knew each other for a long time. And I'm just. This on my. Come on, girl. Let's get to the point already. Just tell these folks exactly what went. I'm gonna tell y'all. Okay, this what happened. She thought that oh, him and old boy, you know, they live together. She, you know, the fact they live in a the hotel. You didn't think that shit was strange? Oh, uh, but anyway, she thought that nigga was fine and all that stuff and all that blah blah blah. So boom, they got to kick it all, talking and shit like that. And then he's supposed to take her on a date. Did he take her on a date? No. Did he take her on a date? Well, anyway, it doesn't even fucking matter. You got the nigga ain't take her on a date. So therefore, she didn't even saw the man had a beer in his hand. And then she saw a pack of beers in his hand. She don't even like the man who drank beers. So the simple fact that she even talked to the nigga, I didn't understand it. And then they were playing video game. He played video game over your suicide. high. That, that should have been a no anyway. And then so therefore, she tried to live with a hot girl or something. And then it turned out to end up being a fucking midlife crisis and then find a nigga with toothless i'm talking about mr one too that's why he was trying to hide the shit in the midnight midday night wow you didn't even like the nigga wow you did it you did it what the fuck girl you did not have to do that man like that you know oh well. damn well i did not okay you like i knew Yes, you did. Girl, you know, anyway, anyway so let me tell the story. So basically, we just start. I didn't judge him based off that, you know, because I'm a person that look inside the heart. <laughs> Girl, please. Shut up. Girl, please. <laughs> but anyway, anyway, hold on. We got to tell this. You want to tell the story? I'm going like, to tell the story. But I so I'm right. gonna just, before, I'm going to let her say the rest or whatever. And I interject when I had to. So basically when I was saying, like, um, we talked for months, but he wanted to be with me, but I didn't want to be with him. and Because I didn't feel like he was, like, that that one. You know what I mean? And it was, like, right. something was off. Like, he was too clingy. And I didn't like that. Clingy. For everything was off. Exactly. Didn't like it. You I tell you right now. I tell the right way. Go ahead. Of the story, the nigga was gay. I'm gonna tell you why he was gay because he had talked to a transgender on the phone. It was left in his messages like a couple months ago, no, a couple years ago, I think. And he told her that, Oh, I don't want you to try me like I'm gay. I don't want you to try me like I'm gay. You had speculation that man was gay, though. No, I did. You had speculation. It didn't even matter. We respect gay people, but at the end of the day, when you DL, then you just. Yeah, it's irritating. And then so therefore she would question everybody around like should I stay with Girl. this girl? And I don't know why you like cause he talked she what did you ask him? I asked him was he gay. You remember you had 
<laughs> yeah, she had that man, that, and then he was like, "No, I'm not gay. Whatever, da 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 da. Whatever." And then so she was eating her ass up, like she did, she broke up with him. That's it. She broke up with him. In the story, we're done. Ugh.